Well, despite a couple of tough shootout losses, lately the Grand Rapids Griffins have rattled off points in six consecutive games as they get set to entertain the Iowa Wild tonight in game six of an eight-game homestand. The Griffins, during this 4-0-2 stretch, have allowed just nine goals in regulation time. Really good defensively, not necessarily a renewed commitment to defense, but stemming more from a system that has been in place from the beginning. You know, we want to play good defense before we can play play offense and uh, usually when that happens good defense leads to, to a lot of offense so uh, just trying to be responsible in our own end um, I think that's going to win us a lot of hockey games when, you know when we do that and it frustrates a lot of teams when they don't get too many chances and you know that's when we take over with you know our skill and, and the depth that we have up front. Well, the recent return of Valeno from the World Juniors and Michael Rasmussen from injury has certainly enhanced that depth up front. Now the Griffins hope to get Eric Tangrady back. Uh, he'll miss tonight's game. That'll be 12 of the last 13 due to a nagging injury. You know, just have back-to-back -back injuries, um, come back from one, get hurt the, the first game back. It's been very frustrating, but um, 11 years pro, I've learned a lot uh, about myself and, and, and my mind, so I'm just trying to battle through. And when I do come back, you'll, you'll have me at 100% and uh, ready to play the type of game I'm capable of. Well, the Griffins enter tonight's play in a three-way tie for fourth spot in the division. Just three points out of third place and 11 in back of their opponent, Iowa, who will hold down the second position in the Central Division standings. Griffins would like to keep the Wild within range, so tonight's a very important game to beat Iowa. Lots of keys will go into it, including shutting down Gerald Mayhews. Uh, got 11 goals lifetime against Grand Rapids, but leads the American Hockey League in goal scoring this year with 27 in just 35 games. It's been a good one for us and, and the team. Um, you know, it's some of those years, you know, the puck just finds you and it's a good thing. You know, you got your line mates working for you and um, it's, just a, it's just a good overall team effort here. Well, that team effort has led to a 12-4-1 record in the last 17 games for Iowa. Uh, Mayhew is joined by teammates Sam Annis, each tied for second in the league scoring derby with 43 points. Chris Terry is also amongst the top five in that points parade in the AHL. Fourth meeting of the year between the two teams. The Wild have won the first three, two of them in overtime. Grand Rapids will start Pat Nagel in goal tonight. Uh, 1.69 goals against in his last three starts for Grand Rapids. The Griffins lost Dennis Chalosky earlier today on recall to the the Detroit Red Wings. The homestand wraps up this weekend, Friday, Saturday, against San Diego. That's it for our game day preview. Thanks for joining us. It's brought to you by Michigan First Credit Union.